In this problem, the order is for L-DOPA, 2 grams BIDPO. Stock for this medication is in 400 milligram tablets. How many tablets would you give? To solve this problem, we need to express our answer in tablets. So we'll set the goal for tablets. To begin a pharmacology problem using multidimensional analysis, we'll begin with the doctor's orders expressed as a fraction. We see the order is for 2 grams with additional instructions in the order. BIDPO stands for or translates into take by mouth twice daily. We'll take that doctor's order of 2 grams with a denominator of 1 for an equivalent value in fractional form. The problem gives us a relationship between milligrams and tablets. However, our order is starting in grams. Before we can convert from milligrams to tablets, we need to convert our original order in grams to milligrams. To do so, we'll create a conversion fraction with a value of gram in the denominator so that our grams cancel out. From metric relationships, gram is a larger quantity than milligram. So placing a value of 1 on the larger quantity, which in this case is gram, recognizing that each prefix in metric system has a value of 10, and there are three place values between the base of gram and milli, which means we will take 10 times 10 times 10, giving us 1,000. So to summarize, that means 1 gram is equivalent to 1,000 milligrams. Taking these equal values, 1 in the numerator and 1 in the denominator, creates a special 1, which, when multiplying by 1, doesn't change a value, but here will allow us to convert from one unit to the other. When multiplying, if we have a common factor in the numerator and the denominator, they will cancel out since their value is equal to 1. We now have our doctor's order in milligrams. Our goal is tablets. And at this point, we'll now use the information given in the problem to eliminate milligrams. We will establish a conversion fraction with milligram in the denominator so that it cancels out. Placing equivalent values in a fractional form shown here with one tablet in the numerator equivalent to the 400 milligrams in the denominator also creates a fraction with a value of 1 that will allow us to convert from one unit to the next. Our common factor of milligrams cancel out. The only unit remaining is tablet, which is definitely an indication that we've set up the problem correctly. Now we can do the indicated multiplication by multiplying the numerators of each fraction together for the new numerator, multiply the denominators together for the new denominator. To finalize our answer, we will Perform the division, which is the numerator 2,000 divided by the value in the denominator of 400, to give us a final answer of 5 tablets. This would be the amount for one dose. Because the problem gave us the BID, meaning twice a day, the daily dosage would be a total of 10 tablets, or 2 times the per dosage amount for our final answer.